So this is it. Let's check it out. This is Power World versus Pokemon comparison. How similar are the designs? IGN is breaking it down. Let's jump in. Eight minute video, okay. What's up everybody, Joshua Yale here. And as a lifelong fan of Pokemon, I'm used to seeing other games in the monster tamer genre that are clearly inspired by Pokemon, like Temtem and Nino Kuni. Yep. But nothing made me do a double take quite like Pal World, aka Pokemon with guns. Pokemon with the guns. The first trailer of what looked like a heavily armed Pokemon trainer using a terrified little pocket monster as a bullet shield was a meme come to life. Make sure it's high quality. While the ridiculous concept is good for a laugh, what's not so much of a laughing matter is how developer Pocket Pair has seemingly copied elements of more than a few Pokemon designs That's what we want to making see. its we own see creatures for Pal World called Pals. Well, I've got a bone to pick with you. Oh my God! Pal, why? Because why this looks like Legends Arceus? Like the you guys can't see because my big ass head is in the way. Like the the thing with the poke the the Pals. Oh, this right here. <laughs> it's, oh my god. To pick with you, <laughs> pal, because making a game with creatures inspired by Pokemon is one thing, but ripping them off is too much. Which, as I will demonstrate, is the oh case. Oh my god. Some example. That was. <laughs> I never seen that pal before. That was this guy. That ripping them off is too much. That was. Which, <laughs> as I. From the side, it looks like a giant brown. It was a water starter with um, score bunny and did he do? Did he have a pop? Did I get a pop of him? No. Um, it was a water starter with score bunny. Um, Snobble, I think his name is. He's like always sad. I will demonstrate. It just looks like the it. case <laughs> in some example. In a whale form. <laughs> Oh my I god. I'm not a game designer, but the and inspiration like the buzz. for Pokemon comes from all around us. See those keys on the counter? Eevees. That could be the idea for or a new Pokemon. Leafy and that ice cream cone? New Pokemon. That literal pile of trash. You get the idea. Yep. The fact that Pal World doesn't have wholly original designs for nah. whatever reason seems wild to me. What's more, by not doing that's so. What, that's what's crazy. Like, can they just come up with like coffee cup and toilet paper? Like, they literally just like looked at Pokemon and was like, "Oh, you have an EV? So do we. You have a Pikachu? So do we. You have Electabuzz? Let's give him a gun." <laughs> it potentially opened itself up to legal action. This is like the most original thing I've ever seen in Power World so far. <laughs> the fucking chicken, and it looks just like a, a fucking thing took out a of Link of Zelda. From the Pokemon Company, and even worse, criticism from rabid Pokemon fans like me. The CEO. Listen, I'm a fan of Pokemon, but I'm not mad. You know what I'm saying? I'm not coming at uh the creators of Power, especially not with death threats. Come on, guys, let's be mature. A pocket Pair has denied allegations of plagiarism. While Pikachu doesn't appear in Pal World exactly, that was Pikachu. That was the, Pikachu right there. The CEO <laughs> right of there. Pocket Pair has Pikachu denied has allegations of plagiarism. While Pikachu does look, look, <laughs> Pikachu right here. You got Pidgeotto, and then you got Umbreon, the yellow Umbreon. In Pal World, exactly. There's no denying that many of the designs this are is Lapras. similar. Whether oh it's my elements God. of different Pokemon thrown Even together Team Skull. to make a Pal, Pokemon look. thrown together to make a Pal. Even that, even the bad guys. Many of the designs are strikingly similar. You got Team Skull over here. Whether it's, it's elements crazy. of different Pokemon thrown together to make a pal that's versus Bowser. Frankenstein's monster to more wholesale similarities. It's at least enough to get on the Pokemon company's radar. The company made a statement saying, quote, we intend to investigate and take appropriate measures to address any acts that infringe on intellectual property rights related to Pokemon. Well, let's do our own research, and you can be the judge. Oh my God! Poor Vulpix. Before I get in the to face. the comparisons, it's important Light to point rock. out I have no issue with the fact that Pal World has elements. This is the the zebra guy. A Pokemon's gameplay. Countless games do the same thing, and anyone who has played the first 15 minutes of Pal World can plainly see that while it does have monster taming, its survival gameplay, crafting mechanics, and the lack of glaring technical issues make it clear that it's otherwise nothing like a Pokemon game. 
For me, it's all about the designs of the Pokemon themselves. The creatures I've spent years of my life getting to know and love, and to see some of my favorites presented in the way that they are in Pal World genuinely breaks my heart because I'm really in touch with my feelings like that. Okay, so let's get to the comparisons. This first group is full of designs where you can tell which Pokemon inspired each Knight. pal, but the pal is a wholly original design. There are many of these, so these are just a few. Oh my to show god, I like the bugs. Relax. The pal called <laughs> Sparket is obviously Pikachu. meant to evoke the Pokemon. Dude, look, we got Pikachu, we got Vulpix, we have Leafeon, we, <laughs> we have a duck. That, I mean, it, it doesn't look like Psyduck, it looks like the other guy. Uh oh. Not Piplup. This guy looks like Piplup. The other duck guy. I don't know the, uh, the other duck guy's name. This is Grookey. <laughs> oh, it's just, it just keeps going mascot, on and on. Pikachu. It's so it's crazy. It's a small, yellow, furry, electric creature, but it's still very much its own design. This little Firefox pal named Fox Sparks obviously evokes the little Firefox yep. Pokemon, Vulpix. Vulpix. And the flaming tail bears a striking Charmander. similarity wow, to Charmander. Wow, that's crazy. But while these similarities are easy to see, they're nothing more than just that, similarities. This is yep. a great example of a pal that puts its own unique spin on a familiar Pokemon right, concept. Right, right, the right, right. I like kind of blue... shout out to the guy that did this video. He's actually breaking it down in a way that's actually smart and intelligent and like, well, you can tell it's well written and well like like I know my shit. I know my Pokemon. Relax. I know what I'm talking about. Ooh, penguin pal. Penguin. Oh, we got some more. We got some more down here. We got um. <laughs> These guys just look like uh Shaming Shaming. I forget the guy's name. Bullet, which uh, reminds um, me of the blue penguin Pokemon. Pip the mythical, the mythical same idea Pokemon? with distinctly different execution. Something now, borrowed. most of Power World's 100 plus monsters are original designs like the ones we just went over. Oh, that but was Eevee. Others bear a much stronger resemblance to specific Pokemon designs, although you might need to look a little bit closer to spot the similarities. For example, these next pals have faces oh that look just like those of certain Pokemon. Faces For instance, look... Mazarina's sleep. Slowpoke. I mean, not Slowpoke, uh, the sleeping guy. Um... Snorlax, right? With the eyes and like the chubby face. The face is the exact same as Snorlax's, <laughs> except they reverse the direction of the teeth. Oh, Grind. Wow. I didn't even notice. That's crazy. Tail has the same facial features. I've as seen this one online with the eyes and the teeth and everyone was saying this Meowth. And yeah, that that's basically, hey, AI, make me a Meowth that doesn't look like a Meowth. And it spit out this. And I was like, oh, I could use that because that's kind of not the same thing. <laughs> Galarian Meowth, save for the pupils. Dumud's face is the same derpy one as Slowpoke's, right down to the oh, way the mouth Slowpoke. hangs open. I, it does look like- The uh, only difference is this Dumud guy. has teeth on both top and bottom, whereas Slowpoke only has one set. It also looks like um, the, the fin is from the starter Pokemon I was talking about. That's what, that's what caught my eye. But he's talking about faces. A striking These resemblance. These pals are largely unique, save for signature elements from certain Pokemon. The crown on King Paka's forehead looks oh, a yep, whole lot like Empoleon's trident beak. Plus, yep. they also share a tall, egg-like body shape when viewed from the front. It's e Look, you know what's even crazier? Like, even down to, like, you see this? It's like, it, it, I, I don't know. They, I don't want to say that they use AI, but you cannot tell me that... Someone either looked at this and said, oh, we're going to take the crown. Oh, you see these circles? We're going to put these circles here, here, here. And then also continue that, that same egg shape. But, but like, you don't have, like, even down to this, this part right here, look, boom, boom. You don't have that resemble over, like, the, the those stuff being copied without it actually being an artist copying it. Or AI saying, hey, Take this creature and draw up a new version of it or a different version of it. And when viewed from the front, kind of weird. It's bro. easy to see that the Pokemon yep. Zeb Strika inspired the pal called Univolt, yep. but enough is different that you probably would not mistake one for the other. This nah. archer pal called. <laughs> what are we doing, bro? What are we doing? You can't tell me this is not Decidueye. 
<laughs> like... Robin Quill has the same color scheme, cape, and bow and arrow weapon as the bird Pokemon Decidueye. Toko Toko is a weird bird. God, I don't know the Pokemon's name. With a name. green, yellow, black, red design, much like the Pokemon yep. Zatu. It also has a similar beak to Toucan. <laughs> oh my god! Like, what? What? It literally just fused those two Pokemon together. It literally just fused those two Pokemon together. <laughs> That's insane, All right, next up, bro. the pals this in insane. this group look like Pokemon doppelgangers, where the base model is similar, but the design on top is different. The humanoid body and pointy oh ears of the- Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. Enter in the, the, the meme. What was the meme? We got a, the, with these guys? Uh, um, I forget their names. Uh, I'm going to enter it in here and edit so you guys can see. It. <laughs> okay, so help me understand. How do I not have a case? That's literally a black Lucario. That's not a black Lucario. That's Anubis. Anubis? In, in Power World, they call him Anubis. Yes. What? They stand in the exact same, though. What? They can't stand up. Come on, his legs are closer. They can't what? Stand the same a little closer? Are you? You don't have a case. Listen, you're the Pokemon CEO. We understand. You don't have a case right now. I'm trying to help you out. I, I understand. Okay. You're my you're client. Right. Like, you don't have a case what? with the dog right. warrior pal known as Anubis <laughs> looks almost the same as That's the Pokemon Anubis. Lucario, although it's dressed in Egyptian armor. Grizzbolt has the same body shape, color, and design elements Electabuzz. as Electabuzz. Yep. The insect pal named Elizabeth. Wow. I'm seeing some of these for the first time, and I'm like, yo, there's no way. This is definitely just the B. The B Pokemon. Has the same snatched waist, long arms snap. with pointy bug hands, and dressed like abdomen as the yep. B Pokemon, Vespaquen. Astagon has a very similar... Oh, my God. <laughs> this is, um, son, that's on uh, the cover of uh, Pokemon White? Build and shape the name. as Mega Agron. Wait, Mega Agron? Oh my god. He kind of looks like... Who's on the cover of Pokemon White? Yeah, I'm not bugging. No, the cover of Pokemon White is a black Pokemon with the... Uh, I forget his name. I'm going to have the box art here. On the cover of Pokemon White. Zekrom. Okay, there we go. To me, that was Zekrom. I looked at that and was like, that's Zekrom. But he's he's right, especially with the feet, with the with the, the arms. I guess Zekrom is more, um, he gets the color and the wings, but then they added shit to the wings, you know? Incineram looks like someone used a Firestone on a Zoroark. Yep. Yep. Ever wonder what Garchomp would look like if it were an electric bug type? Come World on, bro. This is <laughs> not my main Garchomp. <laughs> Ozark gives a pretty good idea with its horns, wings, and a new paint job. Not my man, Gun. Um, Alrighty, next up, job, this man. is where pals start to look a lot more like the Pokemon they're based on. The Jet Dragon pal named oh, yep. Jetragon is a dead ringer for the Jet Dragon Pokemon, Latios and Latias. Yep. Sorry, giving Wooloo a haircut isn't enough to make Lambal yep. pass as a completely new design. That's what Fangalope just looks like Cobalion got caught in a strong wind. Bron yep. Cherry is pretty much just a Meganium with a new hairdo. <laughs> the pal called Wixen might look like it was oh inspired by Delphox, and yep. in a sense, it might be, but it actually has more in common with a fan-made alternate design of Delphox. Oh, and this- That's grimy. They still it from the fans? That's crazy. Don't take fan art and put it in your game, bro. No. Is Creamus. But just because you drop an Eevee, Eevee into a bowl of whipped cream That's doesn't Eevee. mean it's suddenly a brand new creature. Mishmash. Moving along, the pals in this group appear to be built from different parts of several Pokemon. Verdash could pass as a... <laughs> what are we doing? What are you doing? <laughs> this is... A copy of Cinderace that was colored oh green and they stuck on the ears of Leafeon in the weird neck design of Hisuian Arcanine. Oh Azurope is a blue snake-like pal sporting a big head of blue hair, and it seems to have yep. Superior's body and Primarina's hair. Add Lilligan's crown and Meganium's eyeballs to Gudra's body. The color eyes! The eyes, my guys! That's stealing! That's straight up stealing. This is straight up stealing. That's straight. How do you how do you copy a a what? There's Eyeballs no to Gudra's body. 
color it green, and you pretty much have Dinosum. To me, eyes, this is Mega Gardevoir's Ballroom yep. Gown Luke with the Lossum's flowers on top. Whoever created this unholy atrocity combining Mewtwo's thick legs. Mewtwo thick legs. <laughs> yeah, look, even got the toes of Mewtwo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And kind of the hands. Kind of, yes. Yeah, with Salazzle's feminine wiles, we'll never see heaven. It may be pal number 69, but this horror is anything but nice. And finally, these pals are almost know. mere images of their Pokemon counterparts. Boltmane is essentially just a shiny Luxray. However, oh it is God. worth noting that That's while Boltmane was seen in preview footage, it is not currently available in the game. It could have been scrapped or it may be added at a later day. Only time will tell. Dire Howl is little more than a recolored Lycanroc, yep. and you can't convince me otherwise. You're right. Okay, then, that is all from me. These are all the pals I thought had some the similarities Mewtwo. to Pokemon. The Mewtwo, I'm a post. Any I'm a post the Mewtwo. And the Mewtwo, you can't tell me otherwise. They literally took the, 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 like the way Mega Mewtwo is like standing to its head, to the hair, the ears, to the hands, to the... The feet? <laughs> everything. Everything. Shout out to IGN. Shout outs to, uh, I forget the guy's name, uh, Josh. Joshua. P dope video. Dope video going over exactly the issues that I take with Power World as well. Um, and granted, Power World looks fun. It looks fun. And I'm sure it is. I am overwhelmed with games right now that I want to play. I get to power later down the line. Hopefully it comes to PlayStation. If it does, that's perfect. Um, right now, do I want to play it on PC? No. Do I want to play it on Xbox Game Pass? Go through the hassle of setting all that up? No. Um, I think I'm comfortable and happy just letting them build up what they have. Get Because they are in early access. Get out of early access. Be an official game. Have a story mode and stuff like that where you actually have to do shit. Uh, besides just survive so get out of that i think i would try it but i don't think it's gonna have this hooks in me i don't think so but uh let me know what you think about it in the comment section below i'm gonna make this a whole um video of us reacting um to this pokemon versus power World comparison from ign yeah again shout out to ign links and everything in the description shout out to joshua dope ass video daddy Gamer, Fred, and Trash. You trash, Freddy? Your mama!